in one outdoors hunting fishing and the outdoors all in one where the moments happen we'll meet you there i hunt fit strength and conditioning for hunters we help you hunt stronger feel better and go wherever your hunt takes you Hey guys, this is Fish Hunt Wild. I'd like to show you guys how to do the torch skulls, I'm calling it. Today, we're gonna to be working with a skull here that is already bleached white. It's a giant four point frame. Um, yeah, let's get into it. So basically what you're gonna do with this torch here is you're gonna slowly, you're gonna bring it close to the skull if you want it darker. You're going to bring it further away if you want a light brown color. But yeah, you're just going to want to hit the, the, the cracks as, as good as you can. Um, I know that is like what I did with that other one and it looked really cool. You can see it's already getting even on the sides there. Right in there. I want to just light that sucker up. And make sure you do this, you don't want to do this in the house, it stinks really bad. Put the front here. Let's see, where else can we go? Um, let's hit this skull plate a little bit, let's see what that looks like. Also just bringing out the cracks there. Basically what you want to do is if you do something to one side, you're going to want to do it to the other side. Just make sure you're, you're doing that. Um, with this skull, there's little chips here. That's why it's kind of got some weird looking lines on it. Hit the, uh, hit the edge of the, uh, the nose right here really well much as you can. You're gonna really want to bring out, like I said, bring out those lines as much as you can. And hit the eye socket right here really well. Um, when I did it to the teeth, it brought out a lot of color in the teeth. Honestly, you normally wouldn't want that, but it kind of looks cool, so I'll show you what it does. So you can decide if you want the color in the teeth there or not. Um, it's up to you, personal preference, really. Okay, here's another one you want to do on the inside. Um, actually, inside on the bottom there. Like kind of close to the burr here. It's not a big deal because I honestly haven't had an issue with burning the actual antler yet. But 
I would stay away from it. <laughs> That one, and there's my 2016 Mill Deer Buck. 